Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to switch your Soul Plus Repairs Free Coaster Hub from Free Coaster Mode to Cassette Mode. So first thing is you're going to want to take the axle nut and washer off the drive side of the hub. You're then going to want to take an 8mm Allen key, put it in the end of the axle, and then use it as extra leverage with a 23mm cone wrench to get the drive side cone nut off. This cone nut might be on pretty tight. Once you've removed the drive side cone, you're then going to want to take the driver, give it a little bit of wiggle and slide it off the end of the axle. You're going to want to take the clutch disc out but leave the coil spring still inside the hub. You'll see the clutch disc is actually in two parts, there is the clutch disc and there is the spacer. You're going to want to take the clutch disc and it slide it off the spacer, rotate it 180 degrees so the ramps are now facing the back of the hub. You're then going to want to take the clutch disc and put it back inside the hub. Right, you're now going to want to take the driver and you're going to individually, one by one, take out each of the three pulls and the small free coaster springs which hold the pulls down. Once you've removed the pulls and springs, take the small free coaster springs and put them in a safe place. You're now ready to reinstall the pulls but this time with the cassette springs. So take the cassette spring, slide it into the slot and then hold it down, carefully putting the pull back on over the top. If this is done correctly, you will see that the spring pushes the pull up rather than hold it down, which is what happens when the hub is in free coaster mode. Repeat this process three times for each of the three pulls and springs. Okay, once the driver is set up for cassette mode, you're going to want to take it, slide it back onto the axle on the drive side, pushing it firmly in. You then want to take the drive side cone nut, thread it back onto the axle, and then use the 8mm Allen key and 23mm wrench to make sure it's down extra tight. Then simply slide on the hardware and the hub's ready to go. If you then wish to convert back to free coaster mode, you simply repeat these steps but in reverse. Hope this how-to video helped. For any more information, please head to saltbmxparts.com.